Let's take a look at command line concepts. Redirecting unwanted output to dev null. Unwanted output can be redirected to a special file called dev null. Let's try redirecting the standard error of the ls command This directory does not exist, so ls produces an error message. Now, let's redirect the standard error stream of ls to dev null. We no longer observe the error message. ls is still producing the error message, but the standard error stream of ls is being redirected to the special file dev null. Dev null is not a regular file. We can confirm this using the command file. We can also confirm this by attempting to open dev null using less. Let's use less to examine the effect of redirecting dev null. This results in an error message that dev null is not a regular file. We can similarly use dev null when redirecting standard output. and also when redirecting both standard output and standard error. The use of dev null can be useful whenever we wish to discard the results of an output or error stream.